St. Louis Cardinal slugger Mark McGuire. He's passed Babe Ruth, tied Roger Maris, and is one home run away from baseball immortality. It's the stuff. Making sports events. Steve. You always remember who you were watching these big events with. Oh, sure. Never I was forget. home alone in my apartment <laughs> watching, but next game, we've got to watch it together, so All I've right. got some company. It happened to McGuire's first at-bat today against Chicago. Let's go back and enjoy home run number 61, the way the fans in St. Louis did. No announcer, just the sound of the bat meeting the ball. swing away from breaking it um, when that's going to happen if it's tomorrow if it's the next day um, we'll just have to wait and see but you know it's it's been a long um, rough road I mean I go back all the way to I don't know January talking about it into spring training and um, here we are tied 61 And it was his father's birthday today. You will never guess how old Mr. McGuire is. I think I know. <laughs> 61. 61. 61 years old today. What an amazing coincidence. He'll be 62 tomorrow. He'll have to wait till next year. Do I'm to break the record? All right. Thanks, Thanks Steve. Steve. We'll see you in a few minutes. Tonight, Mark McGuire stands on the brink of baseball history, about to achieve the dream of every kid who has ever picked up a bat and a glove. WGNX News reporter Kristen Lee joins us now with that part of the story. Kristen? John, we are in Chicago Sports Bar on Northeast Atlanta, and if you couldn't be in the stadium in, uh, in St. Louis, probably a sports bar was a better place to be. Up front and center, in front of a big screen, watching the game, watching that moment that will be replayed for a long time to come. Good rise, the final rider. That ball is gone, and it's fair. It is... The roar of the crowd has died down, and sports fans have turned their attention to Monday Night Football. But talk is sure to turn back to the Big Mac again, and again and again. But it was an awesome hit. There are certain moments in your life that you'll always remember, and that'll be one of them. It's the stuff dreams are made of. He's living your dream. Oh, yeah. I wish I, I, wish I could be like him. It was, he's awesome. Like they fantasize about hitting it big in the lottery. People of all ages are tonight putting themselves in Mark McGuire's shoes. It's bottom of the ninth, two outs, full count, got to get the last one, last game of the season. And it's either do or die right now. And I hit one out and break the record. And they go crazy. It makes you wonder, do you think Mark McGuire is having nearly as much fun as the rest of us? Does life get any better than this? The home run record and the Denver Broncos on Monday Night Football. No, New England, not Denver. <laughs> no, I can't get any better. <laughs> well, I hope Mark McGuire is having as much fun as we've been having around here. Could get a lot more fun tomorrow if he hits that record-making ball. We'll have to wait and see. Reporting from Northeast Atlanta, Kristen Lee, WGNX, CBS 46. I think it's fair to say Mark McGuire is having a good time. Thank you, Kristen. The home run race continues tomorrow night between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs. Game time is 8-10 at Bush Stadium. As it now stands, the home run tally, Mark McGuire, 61, Sammy Sosa, 58. Be sure to join us tomorrow at 6 and 11 for game highlights, action and reaction to what could be an historic day in baseball. In other news and new tonight,